This here is a brand new coding set by Matatel Labs, a very unique way of teaching you about cognitive thinking and developing coding skills at the same time. Now the way it works is very interesting. Just because it has a control center as well as a control board, relaying messages together at the same time to a smaller robot outside of the playing field. So without further ado, let's go ahead and unbox this thing and see what it's all about. So this here is our box. Uh, it's got this nice casing and you can actually see the images of what's on here. So you got the command center, the command board. As you rotate it on the back here, it talks about a little more in terms of details. Uh, so on the top here, it looks like we have ourselves a map. Uh, this here is what the robot will sit on as well as maneuver on. Now uh, we have ourselves a challenge booklet. This will give you exactly directions on how you were to go ahead and place these flags and where to start the robot. So this here is our control board, command center. And then on the bottom here, you do notice that there is a camera. So this camera here will connect to the robot uh, and relay the message, whatever we put on the board, to the robot. Uh, we have ourselves a tiny little robot. You can see the different sensors here. So we have almost looks like an ultrasound sensor. Uh, then we have ourselves a DC 5 volt charging port on the back here as well as a power button. You notice that there's two wheels on the front here as well as sensors on the bottom here. Uh, and then these here are all the different blocks. So you can see that they have a specific groove that'll tell you how it goes, sits in there. Uh, and then we have these little obstacle courses. So let's try this out. So the first thing we'll do is go ahead and set up our map. Obstacle course right over here. Place our finished one right over here. So we'll turn right and then we'll move forward one. Then we'll turn left. So we're turning right, we're moving forward, turning left, moving forward, turning right, moving forward. Which rotational? I mean, does that mean it's gonna move up or is it gonna move straight? I don't know, I'm trying to think. Let's try this out. All right, okay, turn left, okay, turn right, all right, right again, come on, music. Now he's supposed to rotate a full 180, I think. Backwards, ah, snap, ah, <laughs> there you go, we did it. Um, now, looking at the actual answer guide itself, that is nothing the way we did it. Um, but, you know, we wanted to go through the whole obstacle course. They just looks like they just went straight down and they turned this way and took the shortcut. But, yeah! So, it shows you that you can do it any way you want. And that's actually a lot of fun. Now, let's go ahead and open up that musician box next and see what this is. Oh, oh, sorry. Now with the musician box, you get these different songs in here. So, you know, we have Tinkle Tinkle Little Star. Uh, we have Little Red Riding Hood and there's different songs on both sides. And it teaches you how to go ahead and make music using uh, this coding set. So as you see, uh, these here are the little music blocks and you actually can rotate them. Meaning uh, you can change the number on there. Uh, I'm assuming it's based on beats. So let's just see how this works out. So if I just put five and hit start, this is two. So each number represents a different sound. Uh, so this one here, let's just go ahead and do the Twinkle Twinkle Little Star one really quick. So that's actually kind of nice. Uh, and then you have like these almost like predefined music pieces. So. Pretty interesting stuff. Uh, definitely, again, you know, possibilities are very endless in terms of making your own music. So lastly, we have ourselves the artist kit. Uh, the artist kit allows us to go ahead and use the robot to draw different structures uh, based on coding. So it comes with this uh, predefined set. Uh, you get three markers that they have different designs or drawings that you can go ahead and make. Uh, so let's go ahead and do this and see how this works out. Uh, and then we're gonna go ahead and write these numbers out here. Turn right. Uh, 120 degrees, which is this one right here. And then we're gonna go ahead and go up again. Okay, so that's that. Now the next thing we have to do is take our little robot here, take off the cover just like that. And then we'll take a marker, we're gonna place it through here. 
until it sits just like that, and then we'll hit start. Not bad. I mean, look how straight it is. And literally, this is all from the coating. <laughs> that is pretty wicked stuff. Look at that. It actually drew that. That is amazing. Uh, wow. <laughs> and literally, you're just using a different a variety of variables to create these different forms and you can make different structures or design your own structures and literally the possibilities on this are endless. And with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Now, if you have any questions, feel free to comment down below. And if you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. But either way, subscribe for new videos and we'll see you guys next time. Take care now. Bye-bye.